yeah good morning good morning guys it's just 8 a.m in the morning look at how things looks like here in blackpool today it's snowing i believe some parts in the uk is snowing as well as we leave by the seaside but look at it it's snowing uh it's snowing here in blackpool uh, it doesn't get that worse here so it's a different thing guys today I'm gonna show you how things looks like yeah it's a snowy 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 day guys it's a snowy Saturday what a lovely Saturday guys snow African world traveler here so you giving your update about how things looks like here so this is like a special content for my African and dias I mean African brothers sisters mothers parents or whatsoever that lives on space or stays in Africa you get your family abroad your son your nephew your niece your daughter your in-laws hustling here day in day out you know coming out of this snow going to do like nine till five or six till six you know seven till seven whatsoever safe they do hustling hustling you know and you guys are just sat there in the nice and sunny weather like 30s in the 30 something degrees and you got your son your daughter here hustling in this snow in this weather and this is just like the beginning of december you know this is what we face here day in day out so when we send you money and you don't appreciate it yeah if somebody send you even five dollars or five pounds you know you should appreciate it especially people sending like hundreds of pounds or dollars or euros but still you don't appreciate it come on guys look at this man look at this snow look how it is sometimes people get accident at work you know going to work people get accident people fall people trip you know look at it now this is a quick message from my african or caribbean or people from the third world country you know expecting their sons or their kids or whatever will go to the diaspora risk going through the mediterranean sea risking their life thinking when they come here it's heaven you could just pick it pick money off a tree or pick money on the street it doesn't work like that guys it doesn't work like that it's a real real hustle guys sometimes some people like in here right now in the uk some people don't appreciate immigrants you know not all i'm not saying all don't call a code everybody you know it's not everybody so it's not everyone but i've been called like an immigrant you know can you believe it i'm an immigrant actually but yeah i think i believe majority or most of the british people here they haven't got much rights than i do or i haven't got much right than them, than them so we all equal here because i'm working and paying my tax you know and i'm actually saving lives as well but then you get this low small minded or negative minded people commenting and saying when you're getting back to the boat trip when you're going back to Rwanda you know so you're gonna get that I mean obviously I'm on the media I'm on social media so I'm, I'm bound to get it I'm ready for it you know I'm not having a go at them they can carry on with their small negative minded you know and the last the other comment I had as well there's a guy that came to my life no I came to my comment and commenting and saying this place is this place here belong to i'm not going to name the channel but basically hopefully that person will be watching probably is be spying what i'm doing he's saying this place here this area belongs to one youtuber so that's where he gets his uh, bread and butter right that's where he gets his bread and butter and it's actually not a smaller channel it's a bigger channel it's like how, how many times it's like 50 times uh, 50 50 times than my channel my channel is a baby channel my, it's just growing probably they're feeling a bit of threat about 
a, uh, about a foreign guy or an immigrant like they call people that can come from another country like the immigrants everybody's immigrant if you even if you're born here or you raise here or you spend most of your life here you're still gonna be time as an immigrant even though you're doing a good thing about the country you contribute into the country you've been saving uh, lives you know they still call you immigrant you know they still don't appreciate the immigrants like the good immigrants i'm not saying the bad ones i'm saying the good ones there's good and bad everywhere you go right there's good and bad everywhere you go yeah everywhere you go in this part of the world there's good and bad but you go to the hospital people that save lives yeah majority of them are immigrants consultants doctors yeah they're immigrants so what are you gonna say you're gonna send all those people to rwanda come on now let's think about a great thing you know like they said it's a great britain yeah it's not only like when it's good is uh your english when it's bad you are immigrant no when it's good they are english we're not english we're not we're british what they could call but we're not even called british we call immigrant doesn't matter what we do we're still immigrants because of my name is called the name of my channel many people will come and call a I mean, stereotype stereotype because of the name i don't care that's why that's my heritage that's my roots i'm from africa i'm proud to be african right and I spent most of my life here. And I'm 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 like bloody paying tax. Some of you like commenting, coming commenting negative thoughts on my on my channel. I'm paying I'm paying for your I'm paying for a roof over your head. Right? So it doesn't matter guys, you're not gonna get me anywhere like coming up to my comments saying this place belongs to so and so. Where is it written like it belongs to that person? That person didn't come to my channel and say, oh, you are a threat to my channel. You are you're kind of uh, costing me this and that. No, come on now. So it's either you be my subscriber or you be his sub subscriber. It doesn't matter. If I do good, people will watch me. You know what I'm saying? I'm not here to challenge anybody. You know, it's probably been in the game well before me. It's been in the game well before me. So you as a subscriber or a follower, why would he come being like a hypocrite coming out saying, oh, this place is belong to so-and-so. Come on, we passed that generation, man. We passed that generation. All right? We're not fighting a battle. We're here. He's doing his thing. I'm doing my thing. We're all doing things differently. Right? He might be good in one side. I might be good in the other side. Right? So I might be younger, he might be older. So anyway, we're all doing the same thing. There's no rivalry here. This place doesn't belong to anybody. It belongs to everybody, right? We all have an equal right uh, doing whatever we want to do in this place, right? So people uh, see my name as, I mean, the name of my channel called African World Traveler. And majority of them are thinking, oh, I'm just a traveler. Yeah, I live in this city or in this in this town. We'll say eh? in this town. I lived here for quite a long time. So basically, I have uh, the same right as everybody that lives here, right? I'm not committing no crime. I'm not going trespassing anybody. I'm doing what I love to do. So what? So this is it, guys. So the person who came to my comments and commented whatever they commented. And some of them are coming attacking me let them attack me it's fine i'm good nobody gonna come and bully me on my own channel no 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 no, no. and i'm not gonna get threatened as well that doesn't even move me an inch so keep on trying keep on trying so anyway let's keep the positive energy going let's keep it flowing they can't put us down you get me they can't put us down <laughs> we're far better than that man we're far better than that we know better we travel we travel continent and continent right some of them are just here <laughs> just just in blackpool some of them even they, they don't even move and go anywhere else right let them move let them go continent to continent let's see yeah? let's see they might be pissing themselves man <laughs> they might be pissing themselves without knowing they piss themselves so we are African world traveler. We're going to be traveling around the world. We've got no boundary. We can travel anywhere. Right? 
we're gonna cross the border we're gonna do a lot not only here in blackpool we don't depend just in blackpool now if you watch my videos you can see you can see it's not only in europe it's not only in blackpool we did a lot we're gonna do a lot as well this is just a beginning this channel is a baby channel we started in january all right january we started and look at it how far we're going it's a lovely day look at it guys look at the sky man it's even snowing it's a blessed up day it's a blessing you know it's a blessing when it rains when it rains pour it's a blessing when it snows it's a blessing too so we should appreciate life i appreciate life and i appreciate everybody we all at the end of the day we all human beings right we all human beings so this is it this is the update here in blackpool today how it looks my hands are freezing though <laughs> guys my hands are freezing so guys it's a low tide as well it's got a high tide it's a low tide so let's just go right at the top here so probably uh the way it looks this side the way we came it's not gonna look the same if you go around the back road here right because of the buildings so the snow wouldn't be uh falling the guys it's quite Blackpool Council, if you're watching us guys, Blackpool Council, if you're watching us, it's about the right time for you to come and spray the salt around on this pavement, you know. Because we got some elderly people that's walking through this pavement that need to go and do their shoppings, that need to go and get about. Because as you can see, there's some elderly couples all coming over that side here now, yeah? So anything can happen, they can trip and fall. So Blackpool Council, we are begging you to come out and spread the salt out so it's really slippery you know so there's no grip because obviously you haven't sprayed the salt around you know there's no grip at all and the, as you can see there's some elderly couple coming over this end yeah so there should be salt sp spread all over doesn't seem like you did but anyway i believe you've been watching the weather focus or you could see this happening right now right I mean it'd be nice for you to come out and do do some work spread the salt out you know at least people can walk freely safely we don't want people coming and overwhelmingly in a and e so they got a lot to deal with you know so it's a lot to deal with you know that yourself so the vic has got a lot to deal with not like people having this uh walk just coming out of the street here walking through the pavement and falling breaking their ankle there their knees or whatsoever of course in something else so please come out and do your job man please right i'm pledging see what i just said guys this is what i just saying look he just failed this is what i was just saying right now so we you okay there yeah, fine. this is just so what i was just saying this right now the council should come out and spread some salt love oh god i was just saying this yeah, he slipped on the snow. Slipped on the snow. Oh, see, oh, I'm nearly doing the same thing. Yeah, well. I'm nearly doing the same. He's done the same. Are you alright there? I'm alright. Okay, so you need a hand. You wanna sit up a bit? Sit up first, Dave. Okay. Oh God, I'm going. I'm scared. Oh, as well. Mine. Mine. Stand okay. on here, look. Yeah, see, come you on can that way. Come Careful. forward here, Dave. That's it. Put your foot on there, cause. That... Oh. Oh. Thank you, mate. You're welcome, <laughs> mate. No worries. Thank you. Thank you. Take it very easy. Take it slow, yeah. Very careful there, you're right. I'm all right. Walk down here, Dave. Oh. This is what I was saying. Blackpool, Blackpool Council, if you're watching, come and do your job. Come and spray the salt on the pavement. People are gonna fall and they're gonna break their ankle or their knees. Break your neck. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so here we are. Thank Hope you. You're all right, Thank you yeah? very much. Take it easy. Thank you. All right, take care. You you're mind welcome. yourself. Yeah, I gotta mind as well. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> careful there. Walk here, then. No careful. Snow. Thank you. All right, no worries. If you need a hand, let me know. All right. Careful. All right. Which way are you going? It's all right. We've got looking for. Oh, there's the bus stop. We need to cross over here. And you managed to walk out. Are you okay, Paul? Yeah. yeah, you'll be fine. Thank you'll be you. Be fine. Though. All right. <coughs> Thanks. All right. You're welcome. Thank you. Okay. No problem. Just be safe. So this is what I just been saying earlier. I nearly trip as well myself. Look at this guy. He nearly skidded here. So it's really not safe at all. I think the council is to come up here and put some salt around because people are going to be walking around 
There's another elderly person as well with the electric scooter, right? Look at him now, he's limping. Yeah, he will not feel the impact right now till he gets home. When he sat down, that's where he's gonna feel the impact. That's where he's gonna feel the pain. He's trying to be strong there, obviously, because he's, he's with his missus. And there's people there walking their dogs as well. So people will be excited seeing the snow and they'll be wanting to come out, see what's happening, see what's going. And this is when accident happens, you know, this is when people skate. Anybody can skate. I nearly did as well. And I'm I'm just like I'm a young fit guy as well. It could be anybody. The guy is limping there. So it could be anyone. So the council should come up here. Not only here, everywhere, all this pavement, spread the salt. People will be walking around. These students stop. Oh, I nearly gone. Nearly went as well. So everyone need to be careful, obviously. Everyone need to be careful coming out. This is very dangerous. Right? So I need to be careful myself. I nearly went, right? And I got my trainers. Is he waiting for the taxi? Taxi waiting for him? Yeah, he's getting in the taxi. I think that is the only smart move. Get in the cab, that in the taxi and go. Imagine you got a bike or you got an electric scooter. It could, it's dangerous, you know, I'm telling you now. I just been saying about this and it's not even long. This old man, he just tripped, right? So luckily, hopefully he's all right. Hopefully he's all right. But he's limping at the moment. It's gonna be sore. It's gonna be really, really sore, guys. So just be safe, guys. If you're out and about, be very careful. So it could be, it could, it could come across being worse, you know. So here we are, the ice in, taking the <laughs> ice out. Hey, hello, hello, hello. Are you happy with the snow? Or? It's not an easy thing, is it? No, <laughs> imagine you got a rush and go to work, yeah, and you gotta go and scrape your car, yeah, because we're not used to the snow. Like UK is not used to the snow. It's not like Sweden or all the places like in Germany, Scandinavia. It's not the same, yeah. Just a small snow, and it's gonna be a big disaster. You know, here we are. Some. Some people will be excited just to come out. You will be over excited because you haven't seen the snow for like almost, almost since last December or last November or, you know. And then you eventually just see it snowing. You just wanted to go and see what's going on, you know. And it's not even a lot. It's not even a lot. This is just a tiny bit. It's just a tiny bit, yeah. And it's dangerous this is dangerous it's better it snows more like a couple of inches than this this is very very dangerous feel sorry for the old man you know they're still walking they're still walking by the prom but he's limping he's limping so this is what i'm talking about i haven't even finished what i was saying and then the old man just went boom it's dangerous <sighs> I've only just come out guys to show you how he looks in Blackpool when it snows I just finished my night shift I said I've had a shower and go to bed but I said okay let me come out and create get you get you a content show you how he looks luckily here is a seaside so when it snows uh, because of the sea breeze and the sea salt it doesn't settle it just melts i remember was it last year or year before so it actually snows at work from work to uh, from from when i finished myself getting getting home everything melted everything was melted so and i went to bed by the time i woke up it doesn't even look like it snowed so it's quite weird guys being by the sea so this is another thing man is it's an amazing experience an amazing thing to see it's very very rare around here in blackpool to see like a, a, a heavy heavy snow or a couple of inches snow of snow it's very very rare it's not quite often but it seems like this winter is gonna be another thing man 
seems like it's going to be another one so blackpool council please get a, get out there and come and help the general public spread the salt not only the main road not only the car the people as well the general public gonna be joining the big crossing to get the tram you know or to get buses and that the old man is in the tram there he's sat in the tram i can see him there bless him no 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 actually he's there they're over there sorry that guy looked like him they got the same code so the lady they have to be careful i mean they shouldn't be walking out there if it's me i wouldn't be bothered if i'm that age and i failed i will just kind of like try and get a taxi or something but yeah he's actually been really really brave you know i believe he's doing that because obviously this is he's with his wife so this is how it looks like so you see the flake the snowflake the way he's coming so here i am i'm more covered up i'm freezing though even though i got my gloves i still cold my fingers i can't feel my uh, my fingers now oh god it's freezing see guys my coat is covered with flake it's still snowing it is still snowing guys so what i will do i'll cross the road these people there are waiting for the tram so those couples are coming i think they're coming to get the tram this way I'm not sure but this is going to be even worse guys this is going to be even worse when it turned to be like a black snow <coughs> it's gonna be even worse guys look at it now people are walking here obviously things are building up and that's when the black snow gets developed and created that's when people kind of uh, comes and fall there'll be a lot of love accidents guys look at it now right now yeah when the wind blows you can see the the, the ice is blowing with the wind I will show you once it comes back so you see you see it there you see when it wind blow you can see it. you can see the ice blowing on the top right wow he's a brave man guys he's really brave running on this icy icy pavement it's very dangerous what he's doing there but hmm. it's very very dangerous <coughs> he is not safe at all could just trip and then that's that way some, something something nasty could happen something really nasty could happen it could be anybody you could be like just walking to cross the road look at it look 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 what i was saying see that see it see the wind wind blowing the eyes or the see see that <laughs> that's another thing guys <laughs> it's really nice guys i'm really excited too coming out a bit excited coming out in the snow probably if i go to bed straight away i will miss this out i'll miss out so we won't get this content i'm really pleased that i'm out and i'm really pleased that message i wanted to put out there i managed to fulfill that message because i was talking about blackwood council coming <coughs> spread his salt so that accident trips and all that could be avoided or could be minimized you know but unfortunately as i was speaking it just happened boom like a speak of the devil the old man just tripped and fell luckily hopefully he haven't break anything hopefully he haven't break uh, ligament or his ankle but he was limping but i'm glad he's up i'm glad he's up on his feet uh, <coughs> and carrying it with his business that guy came all the way just to take a picture i believe he's uh yeah he's with that truck there this guy's freezing man it's really freezing i can't wait to get back in and have a having have a have a nice shower and then uh, have a nice shower and get myself to bed so i gotta go to work tonight again as well oh guys Ooh. 
look at that look at that guys look at that yeah <coughs> frozen Ooh. walking hard is a tough <laughs> yeah he's walking hard he must be tired he's yawning okay Ooh. damn see that guys go this way but <laughs> I don't want to take the risk man <laughs> because it's a, it's a medical St Paul's medical center so it seems like this is gonna carry on you know it's gonna carry on let's just see if you can cross the road see how it is the same Snowy Blackpool. So what should we call this? <laughs> what should we call this content, guys? Snowy Blackpool. <laughs> huh? And please, guys, do not forget to subscribe and like and share, please. Please, guys, if you watch the video, don't go skipping because of the ads. I'm not asking anyone for a penny, but please don't skip the ads. Watch the ads. And like comment and share anti-access paint applied okay all right mm. okay. all right it's just gonna walk through here that's a medical center guys it's actually wow I'm really I'm really really brave tonight today I would say for, for me it's night anyway I've been walking all night <laughs> sorry it's morning actually so right this is like wow freezing man there's a pharmacy I didn't know they got a pharmacy here oh okay Saturday Sunday close okay they got a pharmacy up until 6 30 p.m. all right Wow, look at it now, man. Look at the flake. Look at the snowflake, man. Ooh. Let's try and cross safely. Slowly and safely. Ooh, ooh, I think I had enough now. I need to get, that, get back. That pavement is all white. It's white. That van is going to be covered up. So be careful now. <laughs> you better not fall here. That's going to be risky here. Things are here. Very risky. Easy peasy. Hi. Easy. Easy. <laughs> filming again I've been filming for half an hour love I've been filming for half an hour love damn this is freezing man I need to get back in man get back get back get back yeah it was really nice you know when I was walking by the promenade you know the sky you know looking all sunrise even though it was snowing and then the sky was lovely okay guys thank you guys i'm gonna keep it to half an hour guys okay we're gonna end the live thanks for watching
if you went that far watching us thank you very much we really appreciate you hopefully we'll see you again have a lovely weekend guys and stay blessed stay safe and keep being positive positive minded guys keep it positive all the time take care guys one love peace please subscribe as well <laughs>